All right. We're with Rose Fogarty, and she is here from St. Louis with the St. Luke crew. And uh, tell us a little bit. And she wrote one of the chapters in the book, 541, Stories from the Joplin Tornado. Uh, Rose, could you tell us what you're doing in Joplin today? We are all here from St. Louis, part of the St. Louis crew for Joplin, and we've collected probably about four to 5,000 toys in the St. Louis area. And we are at the La Quinta Inn all day setting up toys and wrapping presents for all the kids who are going to come to our event tomorrow. We have a Polar Express theme, and we have 500 kids coming to our event. And we are going to give them all, hopefully, I don't want to say a number, because we won't know until late tonight, but hopefully a wonderful Christmas with all their toys that we have in our room. So it's going to be amazing. St. Louis really came around out and just donated. We had a drive all week last week in St. Louis, and everyone in the community just came out and pitched in. We had about 10 collection sites around the St. Louis area, and then yesterday we had a truck open all day, and we filled a 30-foot truck full of toys for all the kids in Joplin. And it is the Will Norton Memorial Toy Drive. We named it in Will's name. Can, can you tell me... How did you become involved in the in the Joplin tornado relief effort? Um, there was a group of us, probably five to six of us, who founded the group, and we all read and heard everything about the tornado and Will right away in the news in St. Louis. And as a mother, as I wrote in the story, hearing Will's story affected me deeply, and we all wanted to do something, so we formed just a relief effort, and then we started collecting around the St. Louis area. We did a donation drive. In our first um, mission trip, we collected two 53-foot trailers full of donations and drove down to Joplin and delivered them and then worked and did mission work out in the field. And uh, then we came back in July and uh, did a musical instrument drive for Joplin High School. And all of St. Louis came through for that, and we collected musical instruments around the whole city and delivered them to the band director. Well, thank you for all that you have done and continue to do. And uh, thank you for uh, sharing a few moments with us. Thank you, Randy. Yeah.